What's going on, Eagles Nation? It's your man Desert Eagle here, and I'm back at you another video. Fly Eagles fly in the building. First of all, man, I gotta have a special guest right here. Make sure I seen him in person, man. Make this year even more brighter. I am here with the one and only, the true 20 percenter. Give him the spotlight. What's going on, guys? I'm gonna give you 10 seconds to guess who this gentleman right here is. Fuck all of that. If you don't know by now. I mean, it says it in the title, so I'm here. <laughs> Shout out to my brother, man. Space Cowboy 17, man. What's going on, man? Doing Look, good, doing good. That's good, man. We met him last year as well. We back this year. Space Cowboy, I'll give you the, uh, the spotlight, man. Well, look, man, this is going to be a tough game for both teams, all right? No team is going to go in here and they're going to be like, oh, we're going to just roll over. That goes for the Cowboys and the Eagles. I'm expecting a dog fight. I think this is going to go into the fourth quarter or hell even overtime. I think that it's going to come down to what happens in the first couple possessions. Man, I don't know what to think this game, but the Cowboys are our favorite team for a reason. Last game, the fumbles, the turnovers, everything cost us this game. Yep. Ezekiel Elliott, being the best running back that he is, took advantage of that like he should. Man. I just don't know what to think, man. All I got to say is, we got to play 10 times better. 10 times better. We can sit here and say fuck Dallas all day. He can say fuck Philly all day. But both of these teams were 7-7 seven seven for a reason. One team's got to overcome they, uh, their mistakes if you want to win this game. Absolutely. I'm going to say this right now. I'm sure you can agree. Somebody's Christmas is going to be ruined. <laughs> yes. Somebody's going to get fired. A lot is going to happen after this game. I just hope it's not going to be us, okay? <laughs> Listen, I, I think that for you guys, Doug Peterson, he's not going to get fired. He won you guys the Super Bowl. He's guaranteed at least three to five more seasons. But if your defense fails to show up like it did last time, I do believe that Jim Schwartz will not be here next year. I agree. Jim Schwartz. Can we take a picture Jim. of you? you want to hold us for a second? Yeah, sure. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah. Sure thing. Uh, my hands are a little uh -oh. from the beer. I don't want to do that. All right, all right, all right. All right, all right, all right. I'm sorry, bro. Well, I'm kind of, I'm kind of live streaming yeah. right now. Oh, you live streaming? Yeah, yeah we're hey. live streaming. Yeah. Hey, let's go, baby. <laughs> hey, let's go, <laughs> birds. Let's go, birds. Let's go, birds. No, I'm good. I'm talking enough. I'm talking enough. Let's go, birds, baby. Let's go, birds. Hey, stay safe, Tyler. Are you too, bro? Take it easy. Sorry about that. No, here you go, bro. All right. We'll take, we'll take a picture afterwards, but not right for now. For sure, for sure, <laughs> for sure. But, Anyways, um, um, as I was saying, I really do think that if Amari Cooper, I think Amari Cooper, he's been silent, and I really do believe that this is going to be a game where he breaks out. You guys, I mean, as long as you guys can keep the Cowboys offense in control, you guys have this game. I really do believe that. However, I do think you're going to have issues. I think Dak's shoulder injury was upplayed a bit by the media. I think they were lying about it, and I think he's going to air it out on the first play. I definitely think that's what's going to happen. Yeah, man. Amari Cooper. That's why I'm concerned about this game. That's exactly why I'm concerned about this game. Amari Cooper, our shitty-ass secondary. Amari Cooper, I'm going to keep saying this until you guys eventually understand. I'm sure he's been keeping up. Amari Cooper, put him in the same category as Michael Thomas, okay? Adam Thielen, Stephon Diggs, Devontae Parker, Devontae Adams. They destroy our secondary and we could be the reason why we lose this game, okay? If our defense don't do anything about it, step the game up, Cowboys can win this division. I don't want that to happen, though. Yeah, I agree. I don't want that to happen. And just as a heads up to all the people that don't think I'm wearing Cowboys, I am. Let me tell you something. I got his back, okay? Here. Go Birds! <laughs> Go Birds! I'm wearing number 19. I think this guy is going to have a fantastic game today. <laughs> Make sure he's okay, okay? Make sure my man comes out in one piece. <laughs> I Who wants some? All right, that's my brother right there. Who wants some? Who wants some? <laughs> Who wants some? All right. <laughs> now, but in all seriousness, though, I really do believe that it comes down to if the Dallas Cowboys get back. Listen, if they play like at least 70% of what they did against the Rams, they're going to win this game. You guys, if, the thing what I, which, if I'm looking at it as objectively as possible with the Eagles, right, the thing I'm worried about 
about is how effective Ertz yeah. and Goddard and their yeah. running game can be. That's because Dallas play. of recent, they shut down Todd Gurley, and typically their linebackers, and especially with what Antoine Woods has been able to do, he, he really did very well last game. Now, I don't know if he'll do the same performance, or Jalen Smith, or any of those guys, but if the Cowboys can stop Ertz and stop that running game, and they get up early, and Wentz has the throw more, odds are, I'm not saying he's gonna make mistakes, because no disrespect, like, no, I'm not disrespecting, he is a good quarterback. But if you had to make him throw 15 to 16 times a game, you're not gonna win this game. Because you're playing right into the Cowboys' hands. Because that's exactly what they did to the Rams last week. And I think that they can do the same here today, depending on what they do. Depending, uh, I don't know. I don't know, I just, I just don't know what to expect this game, man. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know either. I don't know, y'all. But, what I'm going to say is, it's more than the division rival game, okay? Our teams, we hate each other. Our fans, we hate each other. Unless if you're a Space Cowboy, oh, yeah. Desert Eagle. You know, we like brothers here, yep. man. <laughs> but, <laughs> but it's a playoff game, man. Maybe oh, more definitely. than that. Maybe more than that. I don't know, y'all. All I'm going to say is, man, our defense, if we don't show up this game, our wide receivers, I'm not getting all hype over Greg Ward, not for JJ uh, on single white side. Not a lot of that's just yet, but make sure, you know, ain't nobody looking, you know. It'll be no army against me. But if we, <laughs> if we don't, if we don't step our game up this game, man, yep. the Cowboys are a much bigger team than the Giants and the Redskins. Yep. If we don't step our game up, if we don't take this game serious. That's what I'm worried about. Yep. <laughs> it might be the division rival champions, you know. My bad, you know, my no, bad, you're good. No, I really do think that's the biggest thing. It's like you guys faced the Giants and the Redskins. You guys didn't look so well. I mean, you guys were down in those games. But that wasn't – the thing was was that your offense couldn't get going. It took until the very last minute for your offense to click against these trash teams, to be honest. Because we've beat them before, and I'll admit they're trash, you know. And I'm not – and this isn't a gimme game. Don't let anyone – this is not a gimme game yeah. for the Cowboys by any yeah. means. Yep. So, I'm, look, man, if Jason Garrett is serious about keeping his job, and if this team did not quit on him like they did last week, yep. they'll go into Philly, they'll get the job done, and they'll clinch the title here in Philly for the first time ever. I hope it doesn't happen. You hope it doesn't happen. I hope it doesn't happen. <laughs> Eagles, I'm telling y'all, stop your game up. I'm telling you right now. Jim Schwartz from here on out, his seats need to be on the hot seat. He needs to be on the hot seat, okay? He has been looking like shit for as long as he's been here. And your offensive coordinator as well. I mean, Mike, well, uh, then again, Mike Rowe. but here's the thing, though. The thing I believe that you guys need to do is you need to defer play calling to the offensive coordinator. Because Doug Peterson, he does the play call, right? So, yeah. I think Mike, I think when you guys lost Frank Reich, you really lost some range there. And as well as uh, John yeah. D. Filippo. Go Bears! Go Bears! Yeah, Let's go! Again, I mean, you guys have a formula. If you can get that work rolling, you get up early, you guys should be able to take care of business. But, same thing with Dallas. If Dallas scores first, and they start scoring points, this game's going to be over before halftime, bro. I hope it doesn't happen. I hope it doesn't listen. I hope it doesn't happen. I paid good money for this game. I better hope it's a good game. You know what I mean? I don't know, y'all, but I'm going to end this very soon. I'm going to say it's my man, Space Cowboy. Look, man, pound it. Shake hands on it. To the real fans out here, man, my man, Space Cowboy, I will gladly call a 20 percenter. Simons, I hope you're watching this. You say something, Simons? Any, any shout Listen, Simons, I got the hex on. Don't worry. Hello. <laughs> I got the hex on him, bro. Hey man, look. Cowboys are undefeated when I go into this stadium. We need to change that this year, okay? <laughs> the coffin is not here to cause the jinx, okay? But for real though, man, let's have a good ass game, man. Yeah, seriously, all the respect. Yeah. For real though, man, look. Whatever this happens, happens. Look, look, look. Just make Cowboy, okay? Go ahead, knock yourself out. L listen, listen, man. If you haven't already, Make sure to hit the like button on this stream, by the way. Subscribe to my man, all right? It's number one. 
You can subscribe to me at, on YouTube at Space Cowboy 17 That's another thing. Also, just keep in mind that, hey, the Eagles could do us a favor and fire Jason Garrett and make the Cowboys into a Super Bowl contender. I don't want that. <laughs> exactly. So it's a lose-lose for you guys. Well, 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 I, 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 I want to win this game. No, all joking aside, I'm, I'm joking, of course. I know, I know, I know. But I know, yeah, I, don't, look, I want to win this game as much as you do, plain and simple. Yeah. Oh, man. Look, y'all, look. <laughs> I'm in this I'm in this right now. Look. Shemaine has chicken out of here. Love my homie, yep. Space Cowboy 17. One of the realest 20 percenters out here, man. Shout out to Thank Simon you. for coming up with that mentality, man. Look. Eagles fans, let's get this win. Best of luck to you guys. Best of luck to y'all, too. Made the best team play. Yeah, same yeah. But, uh, I don't know what to say this game, man. I'm lost. Our defense, step your game out, defense. It's either Jason Garrett's going to get fired. Or Jim Schwartz going to get fired. I don't know. Four, one, two, three. Hit him low. Hit him high. And they're all the way over there. All right. <laughs> all right, I'm in this video, y'all. It is Fly Eagles Fly. All right, man. Let's get this job. All right, y'all. All right, y'all. Let's get this win. For everybody y'all that's joining here, do me a favor. Like this video. Subscribe if you haven't already. Subscribe to my homie, Space Cowboy yep, 17, one of the realest Cowboy fans. One of the most knowledgeable Cowboys fans out here. <laughs> One of the youngest cats in here stepping. Man, look. If you don't know him already, come on, y'all. Come on. Step your game up. Yeah, come on. I'm in this video. Go, Bird. How about them Cowboys? Let's get this job done, guys. That's never going to come out of my mouth again. Anyway, go, Birds. I'm out of here. <laughs> All right, y'all. All right, let me get this shit. I actually thought it was going to be.